Uh, so hello everyone welcome to this tutorial in this tutorial i am going to implement uh, linked list using javascript so first of all what is linked list uh, so as you can see over here the diagram is there and linked list is basically very similar to the array uh, but it is the collection of the nodes as you can see over here this is node uh, this second node third node and and so the node can contain the data uh, like string number boolean object itself and uh, it would be addre addressing the next node on the memory okay so uh, let's start with implementing the linked list okay so for this tutorial i'm going to use class es6 class and um, i hope that you people are familiar with the class syntax es6 class okay so constructor So what I'm doing here is uh, I'm just uh, initializing a link means this is a, just the initial state of the link list which the head is null and the tail is null where the tail is here is the end of the link list and the head will con head itself is the link list whole and so let's see what part is equals to new link list and and as you can see why it's uh, initialized uh, it's an empty link list okay so so what about how we will be inserting our data so first of all we were going to create uh, insert a method okay which will uh, can take a value as a parameter okay so we will not be directly appending this value first of all we need to create the node okay for the node i am uh, making another function and um, like uh, link list node okay and constructor So what I'm doing here is uh, this is a linked list node and uh, it is accepting two parameters. Uh, first is value and next is uh, next uh, point object means uh, whatever next uh, node. So by default it is null if no value is passed. So let's node so new link list node okay and pass this value first of all we will check for if uh, the link list is empty or not and the head with meaning uh, returning now so So first of all, uh, what is this condition is for? Uh, it is for checking whether the head is empty. Means uh, it's very the beginning of the link list. So the head equal, will be equal to node and the tail will be also equal to node because both are same for now. Okay. And let's see. 
artist dot pen only stand field oh sorry it's the insert uh, and let's uh, log this artist and as we can see oh, it's head and the tail it's artist tailie stand field okay and next is not um, because uh, that is pretty much so what if uh, we are opening the next okay so okay for that tail the next equals to node and this dot tail equals to node okay and uh, so what this piece of code is doing here is uh, this dot tail next is equal to node okay so first of all this dot uh, head and tail were uh, the same were referencing to the same object this node okay and i just modify the next and so the head also is being modified okay as you know the pass by reference uh, in javascript our objects are passed by the reference so it would be signing a node over here in the next okay and then i am just reassigning the tail this the tail equal to a node so what what it is doing here is uh, the tail is uh, assigned the new node which is going to be uh, inserted and the head is basically uh, also assigned this is very equals to next equal to node okay so it's a kind of circular uh, reference uh, it's uh, referencing uh, uh, each and every time whenever there is a new value inserted so the tail would be first next uh, uh, modified and which will uh, indirectly affect the this dot head okay so let's see and if uh, we can uh, take a step. okay and which and let's say what is the artist and yes uh, so the tail now has been different and do a leap up and uh, it's highly stainful is next is Taylor Swift and the Taylor Swift next is so do a leap yes so this is what we wanted and I hope uh, you are understanding this code means uh, this is just a uh, the object uh, modification when whenever you uh, ob uh, modify an object the parent uh, then this this object is modified okay uh, and the this both were refer referencing the same this is kind of uh, forming a circular reference uh, let's uh, prepend okay so for pre pen, uh, I'm going to take the value and if so first of all we would be creating a node and new linked list uh, node equals to value and for the pre pen logic we have to insert the head okay. So here, here also we can have to check the condition if dot this dot head means it is not null, then it is uh, dot head equals to node this dot tail equals to node. Okay, and Uh, and if this condition is satisfied and uh, return okay and if not then 
again this dot head equals to node and uh, let's say we are appending some artists dot pen Uh, uh, let's say Billy Eilish. Okay, my mistake. Open and that is, and what should be the first value is uh, we can say Billy Eilish. Okay, what if? Uh, there was no answer. Let's see. And the tail and the head are so same. Um, yes, that's awesome. Uh, that's what we wanted. On um, okay. Um, uh, now we are going to open. Uh, sorry, implement the method delete. okay and delete by a value so we would be passing a value and so here we want going to do is check for if the uh, they had and we will be checking if Sorry, return no. So what is this case of coding is um if a head is empty then uh, there is no uh, meaning of uh, to search the value okay. So so we should return over here and if uh, this dot head and this dot head dot value equals to equals to value okay so this would be head dot this would be this dot head is equal to this dot head dot next so what uh, check for if it's the uh, first value okay So what uh, this uh, code is doing is uh, it is checking if it's the first value. So uh, it would just replace that uh, head, and the next value will be pointed as a new head. So as come on, let's see. That is dot delete. Uh, so as for now, we know that Billy Alice is the head. Okay. And let's um, let's say artist. And what is that? And um, you can see there is no Billy Eilish over. So it's um, working pretty fast. In. So what about uh, rest of the never we have to. Uh, so if we, let's current node equal to this dot head so uh, if we will check for the condition current hi the current node is equal to wow okay so while uh, this uh, current uh, current node uh, next so if current 
max uh, value first to value okay uh, it's uh, then we can do is current node dot annex first to current dot next dot next otherwise current node uh, equals to current node dot next so what this is we are doing over here is uh, that uh, we are uh, looping with the help of the while and uh, uh, there is a condition that current dot node next current dot node dot next uh, should be a value or this while loop will be stopping over there okay so the next dot value if current dot node next node dot value uh, equals to value then we are going to skip that node and just uh, assign the next next which would be the uh, next nodes next okay else uh, we'll be looping again current dot next we are going to assign the current node is equal to current dot next okay and what if the tail uh, this dot tail this dot tail uh, dot value equals to uh, uh, equals to so this dot tail equals to where uh, current node So what we are doing here is that if the tail is equal to the value which needs to be deleted then uh, we are just assigning the current node which would end over the second last node as we know by the logic and, and yes. So let's say we are deleting and do a leaper. Okay, and let's say dual lipa has been deleted. Let's see how this and what's the uh, yes, as you can see, the tailor save is the new tail. And what if we are deleting a tail, uh, a tailor shift? Then uh, Billy Eilish. Hilly stand field do a loop uh, uh, and yes this is uh, how we see that there is no Taylor Swift over here yes so also one more method I am going to apply is that is uh, that would be contains a contain method which would be written in a false uh, on based of the value so if possible we also need here to return null okay uh, while also there will be the permission uh, let current node equals to
and uh, so can up next. So what we are doing is we are just looping over the current node uh, till the next value is not null and we are just comparing the current node dot value is equal to value if uh, it's there then it would be written in true or else it would be going to this condition where it would be assigning the next node to the current node and this would be looping again and until the end okay and so let's test it let's not delete anything right for now and uh, let's just test it parties dot contains okay contains a value let's uh, look for the Haley sorry and the string Haley stem Fail and it's true. Uh, let's look for Taylor Swift. This is also true. And do a Leapa. Okay. Uh, and there is something mistake in my logic. I think so. And what is that mistake? And the dual leap is not over there, so it is going through. And dual leap is not available. Mm, it is going current or next. Suppose over it will come Haley. Okay, current or next. Uh, it would be looping. Okay, so we need uh, Okay Not this Okay Yes uh, So uh, actually we are assigning a next a node and which will be the node which would be null or not Okay, and uh, in that logic I was skipping the last uh, link list okay this uh, last node uh, from checking it and let's say billy eilish Okay, the spelling is wrong. Uh, let's say uh, uh, who is not in the list. Drake, that's not in the list. Uh, Lil B. B. It's not in the list, okay. It's really Stanfield and uh, that's uh, Jennifer Taylor's. Yes. So, guys, this was uh, the link list and just the basic method like insert, prepend, delete, and contains. Uh, so, this was for just only basic understanding of the link list. So, thank you guys for watching this tutorial.